What's good? What's good? Let's discuss this, man. Great news. Deontay Williams and Bianca Claiborne, a Georgia couple, has gotten their kids back from a Tennessee police. Check this story out. I literally felt like the inside of my body just was like, just at a sag, a slump. Deontay Williams speaking on a bewildering sequence of events. He was traveling through Tennessee when he was pulled over by law enforcement. It wasn't long before he was arrested and his children were taken away. 11 Alive's Teresa Bowles caught up with Williams tonight who offers some more turns for this unusual storyline. Right, Williams feels he was targeted and treated unfairly. Tonight, he's frustrated and calling out the actions of Tennessee officials. It's a story you'll only see on 11 Alive. It felt like I was dying, honestly, on the inside. Father of five, Deontay Williams, says two months without his kids felt like an eternity. I started having anxiety attacks, but I literally felt like the inside of my body just was like, just at a sag, a slump, like my liver, my heart, like I just, I couldn't bring myself to eat. Williams temporarily lost custody of his children after a traffic stop in Tennessee. He says he and the mother of his children, Bianca Claiborne, were traveling to Chicago. The Coffee County District Attorney says the highway patrol stopped them for a dark tent and traveling in the left lane while not actively passing. The trooper reportedly found five grams of weed in the vehicle. The blood that they arrested me for, but I asked to see the supervisor. Like, let's get some, why am I going to jail? You know what I'm saying? What, what's, what's this about? All uh, right, shut up, you're a criminal. They put their hands on me, got rough. Williams says both he and Claiborne were tested for marijuana. Williams was positive, but Claiborne was not. Williams says the Department of Children's Services bombarded Claiborne's vehicle while she was on her way to bail him out. Williams says they were eventually accused of doing meth and fentanyl. They did a hair follicle test, came back in two minutes. He came back with the paper, wrote in. We then took two more since then, none of them looked like that. The people seen this and was like, who the hell did this? We don't partake. How is it possible? This led to the kids being taken away. William's youngest is five months, the oldest, seven. They held her down and took a newborn baby. They tried to make her pee in a car. You know what I'm saying? It's set four dudes and three men, y'all, around the car looking at this black woman pee. I come out, my kid's gone, and we don't hear nothing for five days. Williams says he spent thousands on lawyers and fees, but progress has been made. Last week, a judge released the kids back to Williams, and that led to a big reunion last weekend. Williams feels the actions of Tennessee officials have been unacceptable, but he admits that he's happy things are finally getting back to normal. I kind of had a feeling like it was going to work out that day. Nobody likes that need to be in a position to break someone's family up when you're doing it out of evilness, out of racism, you discriminate. Williams says his next criminal hearing is scheduled for May 23rd. He's also planning to fight this in civil court. I did reach out to Claiborne's sister to get her to comment this week. No word from her. So what do you expect from Tennessee, man? What do you expect from Tennessee police officers? State, city, they ain't shit, man. They ain't shit. Traveling through Tennessee, beware, man. Take care of yourself. No alcohol or drugs in the car. Tint the windows. Take care of yourself when you drive through Tennessee. The black, they gonna get you. It, it is what it is. It's just one of those states that do not like African Americans driving through. Missouri is another state that are the NAACP put certain states on high alert for black people. Be careful when you drive through them. You can add Tennessee to that list. Just my opinion. Let me know what you think. I'm glad the couple got their kids back. Like, comment, subscribe, I'm out of here.